Dang it, Sticky Keys! You struck again! Message... Okay, but, um... Yeah, uh... But since they they can... They're the, because there's no spell attached to it, they're only the mages can you tap into its magic. Mm-hmm. So now all of us have good weapons. Or at least decent weapons, I should say. Because that was actually pretty decent this time. Hide your kids, hide your wife. There. I was thinking of a pun for hide your mom. <laughs> That's an old meme. Um, I mean, my friend was impressed, but the only time they got him to say that, and it wasn't terrible. By the end game. Ah. So there's that. Because y you've heard how comic stories can go. Mm -hmm. They can go a little. Um, or very much off the wall. Oh. Wait, where did I or you, could, or you could have a weekly event combat going on for a whole year that ends up being all for nothing! <gasps> Forget the battle set up. For what? For nothing! Where did I park my ship? Probably back at Elfland. But, but I thought I parked at the river. Unfortunately, I don't remember either. I parallel parked at the freak on the freaking river, right? Why am I asking you this? Where's my ship? Where did I park my dang ship? Oh, we gotta put that anchor down better. This keeps happening. There it there is! This <laughs> okay. didn't go over far enough north. We, we, we use the employee parking... as this is employee parking lot, that's why! Yeah, gotta park behind the building. Uh, uh since we have magic boosts... I, I am brain dead of directions. Oh. Uh, oh, we should quit soon. For the the part thing. Or, or just keep going and make it a two-part or one again. Because we're probably about 40 minutes in. Okay. Um, oh. Oh, or, or, you, or just go till we're done and see how much footage we get out of it. Yep. Oh, okay, I, I, alright. Fair enough. That's how my recording sessions have been lately. <laughs> uh... When I do a, when I did like uh, platforming games, I like to aim for 15 minutes, but keep myself open to 30. Yeah. Use a usual rule of thumb. Uh, I learned that from my Crash Bandicoot LP. The hard I learned to do that because I didn't do that in that one. I was going for 30 minutes. You should have had to go for a minimum of 15, but yeah, there are exceptions. Of course, there's exceptions, but um, 15's when I would want to start looking for an endpoint. I think yep. that's what I meant. I think my shortest part was like 8 minutes, probably because it was just a good stop. The cloth point. is now useless. <laughs> I think I got more for that cloth than out of that battle a moment ago. Hey, it probably was the reason P.O. Box survived, partially, in the ice cave. More... No, it's weapons I really want to sell. I don't think... But I think he... I don't think there's a weapon shop here. I think the guy here blew it up. No, I... except it's right there. Oh, I know what we're gonna do. I know what we're gonna do. We're gonna. This is good. Most of what we're gonna do is. Uh... No, no, wait. We're we're down here. We might as well uh, find Sarda. Or, or quote unquote find Sarda. What do you got that's useless? Silver axe. It's just a silver axe. It's useless now. Silver hammer. We have the craft sword, and we got the power staff. Oh, Sage's residence. Yes, it's the Sage in right now. Ah, oh, he's sort of not here right now. But um. Psh. Psh. I, I watched a compilation video of a lot of Chucka Conroy's bad jokes and puns, so I've been inspired. I actually don't like the way he does his puns, honestly. 
But it well, forces I... him too much sometimes, but uh, that uh, I prefer. I don't like the emphasis. Yeah. I think you should just drop him and let it do its damage. It's gonna say it with a straight face as a. <laughs> yes. Yes. Make them th work for it. Work for it with you. Though, though, though there are times when you want to do the emphasis just when trying to... Well, I, well, I it, reserve it, the emphasis for if you need it, the emphasis for it to make sense. Does he have five yeah. yet? No. But, you know what, I'm going to buy it now. I got plenty. Or do I? Because there's things we want more. Uh, no, no, no. He can, 150k, I, I think you're good. <laughs> well... Like, one well, of the next things we're going to do, one thing that opened up is major sh is mo even more spells in a specific spot. I was heading there, I think, last recording, actually. Um, but I, I realized I needed the magic key to actually get in there. Mm -hmm. In this case. So, um, I think you might have seen me sa sail around the continent where Onraft usually is a little bit. We were talking about Final Fantasy stuff. I I it was like I said like I think under my breath almost like crap or something and then sail and about faced and sailed back. Yeah, I remember the conversation. I don't remember the world map. <laughs> uh, I have the footage, so I kind of remember and like I rewatch it when afterwards. Cause like let's watch the fun parts again. Ugh. Well, now part of the reason I got into the recording was to be, uh, have it be more with people stuff, because just playing games by yourself is not, it's kind of a, if, if that's all you do with it, it's kind of a selfish thing, sort of, but not if you do it to relax so much, but do you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I'm just trying to make it less on, toward me, on me, that's all I mean by it. That's one of the fun things about having COCOM open during streams. And uh, that's part of why I got in the racing, too. That's even more so the doing something with someone else with it. So I'm usually not an, a, very much good at approaching people. I know the feeling. But, uh, but I, can, I think I'm welcoming if you come to me, but... So it's easy for me to get along when I have to. So I'm not, like, screwed. It would have, I have to work with people. I can actually work with people, it's just I don't usually seek to do so. Oh, these snakes are real pain in the ass, but they just keep coming. I I made that joke earlier this video. Recording. Uh, yeah. Either earlier today or in another session. They definitely sound familiar. I, uh, 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 power staff! Do they have to aspire to new heights? Craft power of crafting. Dun, dun, dun. But, uh, no, we're just gonna go to the Marsh Cave, because it's here. Yep. I probably should have done this it, for... Oh. If the craft you make is actually a bomb made from um, Udi Spines, you're playing the wrong game. I've also been distracted by some guy of a final... another person's uh, been playing my uh, actually uh, the other RPG I've been working on. Well, it's a plot demo. Is oh. all I have for it right now. It's not a complete at all. Like, there's no random fights yet, and uh, the bosses all have one HP. So just to be a filler placement, so that the co I know the code sets up the battle right and everything. That's all. <laughs> So that sounds kind of like uh, one an indie RPG released on PS4 recently it has a story mode where there's literally an I win button for every battle if you don't want to fight. <laughs> At that point, you might as well just give them a cut. You might as well just make an animated cutscene for it then. Like, well, yeah. it's a it's a 16-bit RPG, so it's not quite possible that way. I could do it with, with my things, but that's because I know the thing. But whatever. That's a fun it's fun to explore as well. Oh, but then again, it would even to be fair though. But I, even though I could do that, it would still be a lot of work to do that, which mm -hmm. I usually would rather not. So, 
just like that discussion we had the other day on the FF4 ending with getting all the characters around and all over the place. Yeah, I could make, like, them... Characters like them fight a monster, technically, somehow. Oh, I did that once for a cutscene! I you walk into, like, another party that's actually beating up monsters. Like that. Yeah! I even have, like, the battle music playing for it. I don't know, I like messing with the... the... tropes, I guess. That's not the fun of subverting them. What's the other thing with it? It's like, um... Oh, I was going to say with that. Oh, I also am fond of having deception in stories. Like, some character... Like, you think somebody's on your side, but they're actually not. Mm -hmm. But I like it to make sense, too. Usually. I like a lot of things. I dislike a lot of things, too. One thing I actually dislike a lot is fights you have to lose. Um, I would rather it be a cutscene if it's a scene like that, is my honest opinion. Yep. Or at least make it possible to win, get an extra bonus from it. That's pref uh, that's better, but I just prefer the, um, uh, that you, there's not a, that they, they kill you in the cutscene or something. Mm-hmm. Because it's like, oh, there's something you're supposed to do here. No. No. Uh, that's actually that, a that's... nice subversion. Oh, sorry. In FF4 Ultima, or if you're supposed to lose that battle against Kane and Fabul, uh, with the right setup, you can keep yourself infinitely healed, and should you win the battle by taking down all 65,000 of his HP, you'll get some mid-game gear as a reward. <laughs> uh-huh. And, I mean... It's not to complain about when it, that it's been done, it's just that not my preference. And I've explained why. Mm -hmm. And another battle. Flame. Ice. Dragon. Hey, Skamir! Was this overkill? Nah. Is that because there's there no are, such, is that there's because no such thing as overkill dying? when it comes to giant spiders. I have a f Yeah... Across the train of thought, giant spiders, uh, Lord of the Ring- She loved Lord of the Rings, spiders in the Hobbit, in the- in the Peter Jackson Hobbit, Dwalin has- One of his hammers is named Biter, so it came full circle. <laughs> so let me- so let me get this straight. The best fight battle with a- The best epic battle with a spider in your case is one where- Is- Any one where the spider dies, right? Yes. So would you be willing to watch an epic battle, a long epic battle with a spider, as long as the spider died in the end? Uh, tough call. Because that movie, Arachnophobia, that's the only horror movie I've never been able to get through, because I'm a huge arachnophobe myself. Um, okay, let's see if Sardis actually appears. Dang it! Yeah, that's right, he's Sarda not here. <laughs> yeah, only Sarda not here. Sarda, kinda. Of course, that, that would be the way to best way to avoid unwanted company. Just turn yourself invisible. <laughs> He's supposed to be there, though. I didn't want him invisible. I don't even have an explanation for what for what he's doing in here specifically. Well, if any of you viewers have been trying to play this blind so far, <laughs> or how did you get access to this in the first place? It's my first question. I keep a tight lid on the stuff, most of the stuff I make, <laughs> and the least tight lid is the RPG stuff. Uh-oh. Ah, and the volcano, so it must be a hot rod. So, now we gotta go all the way to Volcano to remove all the Earth Seals in the world. Which, I think there's only, like, two. Maybe that explains why they're all aquatic now. But it doesn't review. But it's not the seal for the uh, darkness fiend. So once we do the volcano, we can actually go deeper in the thunder cave. But it's still in the first floor of the volcano. I've been a long time since last thunder cave trip. And we don't go to the volcano by going to where it actually is. No, we have to go back to the light world to the north to go the, to that tunnel to take us to the south. So it goes so south north. South. To get south. 
to go to east. Does it make sense? No. Good. Gotta clean up the scum here. Behold the power of Windex! That was a fire spell that killed him, right? I think so. Well, it, it, Windex combined with a lighter. I mean, doesn't anything that spray kind of flammable somehow? Uh, a lot of it, yes. Yeah, I actually don't think Windex is. But yeah, a lot of aerosol stuff. There two. Uh, let's see. The next main thing to do, uh, we're gonna go for what I was going to go for in that last episode. Or at least recording session at this point. Uh, it, oh, right, right, that one was kind of long, on the longer side. Even by the... Like, I, I've kind of been stopping making them... Cutting them in two parts a bit. But that was because, uh... We didn't have good ending points in the middle. That is the way it goes sometimes. And it was less effort to edit it. That's, that's how I felt during the... Ronka Ruins and FF5. I split into three parts because there just wasn't a good midpoint, but all in one video was still too long. <laughs> you want a 45 minute video. Oh man. It's like, do I even have to sacrifice any jokes we say during the battles? Best only if there's no commentary during them. Actually, for a while I was editing out random battles, but then decided. It now since I'm just basing it off the stream recording and there's probably co-com, it's not worth the effort at times anymore. I lost the timing to say that was beyond the shat- that left me with a shadow of a doubt. Indeed not. I was, I, I was gonna try to say that in the last guy. But whatever. That was Things just happen. a shadow of his former self. Uh, there's another werewolf. These guys are actually not weak to the bane. I don't know, you had them last. Love that one. Well, um, we're just gonna gut him up and wear wear him like a coat. <laughs> That'd be hilarious. There's an RPG when you kill a werewolf, you get an armor, a wolf skin. Well, that uh, kind of happens in Trials of Mana, depending on if you're using Reese and get the right class change, because she does wear a wolf pelt. In, I think her uh, Fenrir knight. Uh, okay. I can't wait for that. Two more weeks! Uh, now I just gotta hope I, I that the game didn't force another weapon that showed up in the edition before this one that, uh, in that, that place we're going next. There really shouldn't be any special weapons in the next spot, but... Well, it's, I guess it depends on how you define weapon. Somebody other than P.O. Box. And let it kill them all as well. Hey, it worked! We finally didn't use to charge. And nobody got poisoned. Well, wolves can't poison us. You never know, it could be a bug. Um... Uh, speaking of NPCs that get in your way like this, uh, in the Final Fantasy IV randomizer, they recently implemented a press B to jump version. And while the original intent was to be able to get around um, townspeople get in your way, it is so wonderfully broken, it's hilarious. You can use it to sequence break almost every dungeon. Hmm. Let me think. Uh, what was it? The. Uh. Oh yeah, yeah, that's why in the new RPG I have, the characters are just standing around. Yep, so they don't get in the way. <laughs> My explanation is, they aren't really, it's just a metaphor for what's going on anyway. That's my reasoning. And anytime wa uh, whatever. And it's more convenient for the player, big time. So... I don't think anyone would complain if that's under those conditions. It's like, 
they're not gonna get in my way! Unless they're literally a roadblock, it's like, you can't go in this door. Then it's- then you have to do something. Those people are like, okay, that makes sense, or we just have to deal with that. You're the interesting person. With that type of thing. Uh... Light him up. Twice. And we're not going to the volcano right away. So I think I nerfed the power staff's attack from the last time I played this. Originally it was 100, now it's like 80. Ah. Well, because it was a little too strong. It, not More because it overpowered other things later. That it, it should. To some degree. Whee! Whee! And this little pirate went wee 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 all the way home. All the way home. All the way to all, no, all the way to De to Davy Jones. In this case, never mind. Flashy endings. Uh, I guess we'll see what happens in the next area. I guess. Okay, I guess we'll just do the shot. Three dis is that just mirror the, or the three discolored spots of water? A few screens back. The Probably. Movies. Maybe. Honestly, the what what happens to the water is the least of my worries. Yeah. In this, given the other things that have gone wrong. I'm lucky if that's all that happens. Is there some grass in the water? We don't get the airship until, uh, at post Thunder Cave, if you're wondering. Post Thunder Fiend. Oh. This thing. This makes it harder to do this sailing south. But since we're on the leftward side... We should go down to the Onrak Continent. Which... Onrak Continent. Onrak Continent. Onrak Continent. And more pirates claiming to seize the day. Onrak Continent. Onrak Continent, Onrak Continent. Okay. Uh, we're going to, yeah, we're going to the Onrak Continent to get something. I, I was just trying to... No, I only said that to keep my conversation on... Remember what I was talking about. Please, no. I... Uh, wait, yes, this is it, this is Onrak it. Onrak Continent. Now he's... Uh, but I was gonna make that one of the fights I, sk I cut out, actually, so... Oh boy. But will I cut out- no, but we haven't ran into gators before. Oh. Most of them are- I don't know if these spells are gonna do that much, so... Uh, that I think ice- rushing for the door! Gator and don't let her in! Dragon and well, light too will. <laughs> We're gonna have southern fried gator tonight, boys. Tastes just like chicken. Have you ever had gator? I have not. But that's what they tell me. It it it'd either be uh, out here it'd either be uh, very incre incredibly expensive. Or in a can. More likely, the latter. And still probably expensive. Now, I think there's a... a there's a reason you can't... Uh, I'm gonna try to scout ahead to see why you can't go to Onrak yet. If I don't run into random battles. Never mind. But you're not supposed to be able to go to Onrak yet. Why the north part exists. Okay, that's passable. Yay, free Kevin. So I learned how useless caverns are in this game. Really, only the houses are worth it. So this is basically Cardia. But I think we need the magic key to get in here at all. That's why that, that room is there. So... Why did I decide to lock this place up with the magic key? I don't know. This is about when you're ready for the stuff here. 
That's the best reason I got for you. Bahamut's still in here. This, well, he's not in Narcardia, but... What's it? But, you know, this place is kind of mysterious, and it's owned by dragons, right? So, magic! Good old dragon magic. Good news is, we actually have things that don't, uh, use... I don't know. They don't use heal it. No, no, no. I forgot. I messed up that sentence big time. We, we get a lot of spell... There was no shop that had level 6 spells before. Or too much. Hey, get your cake and eat it too. So now we get Lightning 3. And he's also going to learn Quake. Now, I'm going to note one thing about the... about uh, I made a huge change to Quake. Quake is now an attack spell. Mm -hmm. it's, I think I brought that up before. It's just as strong as Lightning 3 in terms of its power, but I think its range is a little less. So Lightning 3 is probably going to do more damage for the same amount. But it's good to have both right now. Oh. I'm pretty sure that's unchanged. Left? Left. Last time I was... Never gets old. Last time I was in this cave, uh, in the previous version, we got the freaking rapid nunchucks in here. Which... Not, or not, which was a little too good right now. But that's going to be pretty soon. There's house. Houses are actually really good, because they restore charges. Dang it. No. I, I found another one there! Or did I get the loot in this one, at least? Don't remember. Yeah, you didn't. Yep, see, there's a rapid nunchucks still. Ugh. No, they better be in Thunder Cave, or I'm coming back and getting these. Can anybody equip them is the question. Uh, yes. Yes. Um... Uh, it's not a spoiler, because I've already talked about them. Uh, they're basically more like a machine-type weapon. It's how they work, so only your mages can... Only the two uh, weak mages can learn use them. Ah of a thing. Um, the, but the real reason they, that most people can't wear them because they would get your um, hit percentage to... Uh, it's too much hit percentage for some classes to make sense for, and the whole mechanical gimmick. Yeah, sorry, Dragon. You weren't doing a very good job guarding that chest. Roar! I'm the Dragon Guardian. Thanks, I mean, you your gassy friend. Your gassy relative. Or distant cousin did a much better job of that. I already checked that one. Um, I just don't remember if there's any. There's nothing particularly interesting down here. Uh, the main thing we were here for was the magic shops, and th that rapid nut check was not supposed to be there. Just wipe that from your mind, viewers. <laughs> it is coming up soon, though, and I I did test it at this point, and it was helpful at this point. So I don't know. Right. At, uh, we should at least stop. I think like it makes most sense to stop at a town of some kind. <laughs> yeah. We're at over we're at over an hour, so this is the time to cut it. Oh, that's the other reason I like shorter videos. Uh, my it, they load in my editor better. Oh yes. Yeah, for a while uh, when I was editing some races together, Novo would send me his direct footage, twice the file size of everyone else. I said, oh please upload a copy to YouTube and send me that. <laughs> If anything I have is over a gigabyte, I will, uh, I have a way to shrink it down. That's my rule of thumb. If it's less than a gigabyte, might as well just send it. Yeah. And it's like, if it's above an S, if it's SNES or lower quality, like 16-bit or lower, it's usually per going to be fine. NES is even be particularly good. I guess SNES does push it sometimes. Oh. But if you go to N64, 
ha ha ha, or any kind of graphics like that. Oh, it, your, gra your bites are gonna explode. Yes. Yeah, so I'd like to do some less plays of Wii and PS4 games, but uh, well, one and my Elgato, not like Windows 7 anymore, and two. I don't know if my computer can handle files that big on a regular basis. Uh, well, I actually had to... The recording uh, software I'm using, I had to get to do LPs. I wanted something that could handle 64 bits. I got a uh, Bandicam. This was like, what? Uh, what year would that have been? Like 2011 or something like that? 2010, 2012, something like that? Probably. I don't Long think... before we met. I don't think, uh... What's its fit? I don't think, uh... A very good free option existed that in those years. Note, very good fr and free. Nope. And I this was like... Less players were using camcorders. This was, um... The full version of this was like $40, too. So it was like, compared to everything else, that was pretty good. I didn't have to spend a hundred dollars, and I get could record as much as I wanted to, and it's worked ever since. So, but I think uh, no. Uh, what's the the one now? The one you stream with? OBS. Yeah, that one. I pro that would have been the best one back in the day. That would have been better than this because that one costed nothing. On a similar vein, I keep getting notifications from Sony to upgrade to Vegas 14. I said, why? Vegas 11 still per works perfectly fine. <laughs> There's all the features I need for editing. And huh. back to the desert. Space because... is still combing it. Oh, let's... No, no, let's stay in the... Yeah. Uh, oh, I know where we're... I'm going to end the video. We'll end it in town, but there's a message I actually skimmed over. But it's we're gonna cover it in the next uh, probably the next recording, which is probably gonna be another night at this rate. Yep. Uh, let me. I'm just checking charges for a second. She still does not have five. So once she gets five, she can actually learn life. Uh, wait, why did if he can't do that? Why does if he can't learn beam? Why did I give him level four? Well, I, I know he can learn level four. He learn beam when he upgrades. Uh, no, okay, that's basically the ending for the... But here's the real ending. Hmm. Can you read this? Rewat et nisi sigam. Uh... You, what? Uh, you know... But you know the backwards thing. Yep. So, yeah, there's magic in the tower. Of course, if it's an alien princess telling us she'll be thinking of us, we're playing the wrong game. Alright, so, uh, next time we will, um... Ooh, ooh, no, I'll, I'll give some... Yeah. This time, we will go to the volcano and get the earth seals removed, and we will get the str the be the ultimate signature weapons for the war girl and the sla and the slasher. In the dun, dun, dun. Next, uh, or at least we'll try to get both of them in the next episode. See ya. Bye, guys.